have patients that have uh, severe cardiomyopathy, patients that have severe heart problems, lung problems, patients on home oxygen. Um, and, and some of those patients are kind of borderline bedridden and, and don't necessarily need an elective hernia repair. Active patients that, that have those comorbidities uh, and there are significant concerns about them going to sleep do really need their inguinal hernias repaired because they, they will become incarcerated and they will uh, generally become a surgical emergency in the middle of the night at the worst possible time when the patient's on anticoagulation and least able to undergo any type of anesthesia. So we, we have plenty of patients that you know you have to be careful about putting them to sleep uh, but certainly you know, I've, I've got a lot of experience fixing especially inguinal hernias under local with IV sedation. That's a much safer options for that's a much safer option for people with significant heart and lung problems.